Hello everybody, this is John. Welcome to another video review. Today, I am getting food from Taco Bell, as you can see. But this video is going to be a little bit different than typical, I would say. Um, because this video is partially about a review, but it's also partially about a promotion that Taco Bell is doing. Um, so there are two newer things that I'm definitely going to be reviewing during this video, but what this video is going to be about is this, how I could win an Xbox Series X from posting this number. By the time this is out, I will already have used this, so you can't use it again. This is a medium drink from Taco Bell. You can get medium or large. I went during their happier hour, which makes this only a dollar. Um, I don't know if that hurts my chances, but it makes it cheaper to play along. On their website it says, step one, get a medium or a large drink. Or they have a few ways to get free entries. One is like a very specific three and a half by five card filled out, only handwritten, nothing typed. Not an envelope, has to just be a card with a single stamp, handwritten, specifically asking uh, for the entries. It's a, I think it's, it's just a way to cover them legally to say that like no purchase is necessary, so this is not gambling. Um, they also have like three codes that they list, um, but they specify that they are only, those three codes only work during a specific time in October. Um, this has been going since the 24th of February, and it goes to November the 4th. Uh, they have um, once every 15 minutes, an Xbox Series X will be won. Uh, they said the intervals are random, but if you look on their rules, it has the exact number of, of potential winners is the exact amount of 15 minute intervals in the days from the 24th to the 4th. To me that means every within the, every 15 minute block uh, there is a potential winner or there is a winner. That means the later in the period the less chance you have of winning. So technically you want to put your code in at the beginning of each 15 minute interval. Currently it's five past the hour, so I'm getting a little late. I wanted to do it earlier, so I'm going to go ahead and jump in and put my code in. I already had this set up, so all I have to do is put in the code. There's some steps before this. X, X, seven, N, W, Nine R Z M R B X S X seven N W nine R Z M R B X submit. Sorry, not this time. There's still time to play up to three times per day till November 4th. Get another code. And it gives you the link to the free ones, which half of them you can't use until midway through October. And the other way you have to hand write a three and a half by five card to do. Essentially screwing you over um, for the free entries. So, I guess I can't win this time. However, they do have a second chance uh, scenario. They call it a fire drill. And any time, any, if you put any code into this and it doesn't win, then they have a thing called a fire drill, which is a 24-hour period of time where they're going to give out other gift cards and Xboxes and uh, Game Pass subscriptions. I think it's like a six month pass. Uh, in order to get that, you just have to respond to an email you're going to get during the time, which I don't tell you where it is, 
but since I submitted one that didn't win, I will get an email at some point. Within 24 hours of receiving that email, I have to respond or else I forfeit my chance for the second chance win. So, didn't get an Xbox Series X. That would have made a cool video if I actually did, though. Um, you can do this online or you can do it by text. And if you're an instant winner, you'll find out immediately, which I did not. New winner every 15 minutes. Maybe if I was right at the hour, I would have won. Who knows? But uh, the drink I got was a Baja Blast Zero. I don't think I've had this before. Sometimes you just don't know if they gave you the zero or not. It's really tasty. That's a, a very tasty drink. The only reason I got that drink was really for the cups to see if we could win here. Uh, let's go ahead and move on to some other things that I got. This is their new item that they are showing called the Double Stack. The Double Stack is just like one, it's like a quesadilla, see? And they fold it over twice to make it a Double Stack. There's only two things in here, meat and cheese. And it is $2.49 by itself. And it is $5 in a combo, which you get two crunchy tacos and a drink with. This is not brand new. It was uh, in Taco Bell before. And it actually came out as a dollar menu option. Which when you think about a tortilla with meat and cheese, and that's all it is, is their, their cheap ground beef, their cheese, and a tortilla that has a dollar menu written all over it. Everything else in the dollar menu are very simple things. They have a cheese roll up. It's just a cheese and a, and a tortilla. They have like the bean and cheese burrito, which is just bean and cheese wrapped in a tortilla. They have like the beef and cheese burrito. Again, I think that's only two things. So this being $2.49, I think is kind of ridiculous. Go ahead and taste it though. Meat and cheese. That's all it is. Meat and cheese. No rice, no lettuce, no other sauces of any type. It's just meat and cheese. That's what it tastes like. And the other thing that's new that I'm going to review for this video is this. This is their Dragon Fruit Freeze. In the picture, it looks more white with more like a stripes of this pink stuff, but it looks like the pink stuff all just mixed in. Oh, it. it says you can also buy this without the syrup. And it's just white. So is the dragon fruit the white part or the pink part? Let's give it a taste. It's really sweet, which is interesting because if you've ever had a dragon fruit, dragon fruits aren't overly sweet. Dragon fruits are nice and crisp. They have a crunch to them. They have a little bit of little seeds in them, but they're kind of like a mild flavor and they're not overly sweet. This is very sweet. I know you can't have like a a dessert frozen beverage and have a mild flavor and have people be happy. That being said, it tastes fine. I don't know if it tastes like dragon fruit. It just tastes like a like a red fruit, almost raspberry like. 
In fact, I would say very raspberry-like. If you were an expert in dragon fruits, you'd probably be disappointed. Um, I'm going to give the double stack a 7 out of 10. It's fine. It, uh, it's nothing new. And it's very basic. It's kind of overpriced. The drink. Again, I went for during happier hours, so this was only a dollar. So I'm not disappointed in that price. I'm disappointed in the advertising that that as any kind of dragon fruit. What they should have had is like little black seeds in there to make it more look like dragon fruit. And also, it's red. The part of a dragon fruit that you eat is on the inside and it's white and black. It's not red. There's another strike against you. I'm going to give the dragon fruit a 6.5 out of 10. Uh, so there you go. Didn't win the Xbox Series X. Hopefully, when I do the second chance, I'm able to respond in time to actually have a chance of that. Let me know if you guys have gone to uh, Taco Bell since they've done the Xbox game. Maybe you've won. Let me know what time it was if you've won. Because my theory is that it's at the top of every 15 minute interval. Currently it's 14 minutes after the hour. So I think if I might have waited until the end of this video and done it right after 15. My choice, my chances might have been a little bit higher, but it's not. Can't complain about not getting something for free, but I just wish like for the video sake, it would have been awesome. I could have also just lied, but who's saying I'm not right now? Anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for that thumbs up you just gave me. And we'll see you next time on another episode the fat hipster. Until then, bye.